Hi everybody here with my uh, PE580 Unit 1 forum response about uh, why do you do what you do or why on earth are you are you doing this coaching and teaching um, I got into coaching and teaching because I love kids love sports so I got into PE I taught uh, PE kinder through 6th grade for 13 years I'm now currently teaching first grade in the classroom uh, hopefully for not not too much longer I'm and over that and ready to move back into the PE but uh, I coach high school soccer but it's in a different district so I'm hoping to go to the high school district um, next year hopefully we'll see uh, but as far as the distractions uh, the video um, radio I never got to see the the movie but totally forgot all about that and I know Cuba Gooding Jr. did an awesome job in that movie so I want to go back and watch that sometime soon but as far as the distractions I wouldn't call it a distraction but um, a couple of years ago I had a kid come out for high school soccer team he actually he came out for the JV team um, and uh, he has cerebral palsy um, a mild case of it but he had a notice, noticeable um, uh, limp and uh, he didn't have full uh, motor skills in his one of his arms I think it was his right arm um, but the kid loves soccer and he just wanted to be out there and be part of the team um, and actually my JV coach has a daughter that's uh, has cerebral palsy and she's actually in a wheelchair she's more severe so um, JV coach really had um, kind of took the kid under his wing and uh, he asked me if he could keep him around um, and possibly play in games later on like when we're winning by a lot of goals maybe put him in or something but we would see down the road and then one said sure why not let's as long as he got his physical and all that he was clear to play um, he wasn't quite you know at the level of everyone else but he just wanted to be part of the team so we let him um, practice with the team and stuff, and then eventually toward the end of the season, we got him in a couple games with the JV. Um, then last year, he was a junior, so this year he's going to be a senior. Um, he wanted to play varsity. Well, he wanted to come out for varsity, but he knew he wasn't good enough to make it that level, so I told him, well, if you want to be our team manager, you could do that. And actually, some of the other players mentioned that because they're friends with him and they know he just wants to be around the guys and be part of the team um, some way or another, uh, just to have that uh, bond with the guys. Um, so I had no problem with it. So he ended up being our team manager. He practiced uh, with us. Once in a while, he would practice with us. He does some of the stuff on the side. I, last year, I had knee surgery in the middle of the season so some of the soccer drills he's seen me doing before and I had him involved in some of them just making like simple passes and stuff for the guys for shooting drills and stuff like that um, so he actually helped me out a lot last year because I, I was on crutches for half the season basically and before that I was limping all over the place so he actually helped me out a lot um, but it was it was really cool the kids treated him very respectful nobody ever made a phone of him or anything like that so it was, it was good to have him around and I look forward to hopefully he's coming out again this year I haven't talked to him in a while but I'm sure he'll be out there and uh, be part of the team again this year but uh, that's my distraction I guess um, I want to talk about other distractions uh, my niece who I actually live with wouldn't definitely would not call her a distraction but as far as my school work goes it's really tough for me to to uh, sometimes I'll leave work like my last class was really busy with the uh, 582 uh, sometimes I'd leave work and go straight to the library or the coffee shop and I'd come home and my niece would be asleep um, by the way my brother and his fiance and uh, baby we all lived together me and my brother bought a house together years ago but um, anyways um, a lot of times I want to leave work and just come home to see her as I hate coming home when she's already asleep so I guess she's kind of a little distraction 
but just because I want to come home and see her and spend a little time with her before I go do my work. And uh, so I think that's about it. Thank you.